Hello everyone. Welcome to WeBotep Academy. My name is Mr. Pawan Bhuya and today I'm very happy to let you know that we have created a playlist for Flutter mobile application development using PHP and MySQL. The main objective of WeBotep Academy is to bring an IT revolution in India by educating the youth with proper technology and market linkage. So here are the eight chapters which we'll be covering in this playlist. At first, we will learn how can we design an admin panel using Bootstrap? In the chapter number two, we'll be connecting that admin panel to MySQL database and we will use PHP as the programming language. In chapter number three, we'll be learning root functions of PHP. Root simply means create, read, update, and delete. In chapter number four, we'll be creating our first Flutter UI and we'll be creating the UI for one product e-commerce application. It will be an e-commerce application for a single product. In the chapter number five, we'll be showing data on the app from our admin panel, which we'll be building with the help of PHP and MySQL. In the chapter number seven, we'll be adding e-commerce function to the mobile application. In the chapter number eight, we'll be checking orders from the admin panel. So if we build an e-commerce application, people will be able to place orders directly from the mobile application and we'll check all those orders uh, which we'll be receiving from the mobile application on the admin panel which we will be creating through PHP and MySQL. At the end of this playlist, you will be able to create Android application, iOS application and both the applications will be native, not PWA or web application. These applications will be purely native web applications as well as there will also be one web application which you will be able to build with the help of these videos. We'll be using PHP and MySQL for the backend of the mobile application because even in today a lot of web developers prefer using PHP and most of us may also have some prior knowledge of PHP. So without wasting any time let's get started and dive into the first lesson. In the first lesson, we'll be creating the admin panel using Bootstrap. And don't forget to subscribe this channel. 